a strange idea. So the that I mean the idea is that that once you when you like when I'm when I'm dating Brittany and I show up to see her and say, Hey, you look great, you know, she blushes, she giggles and everything's great and I, I feel I feel like she's taken my compliment to heart that it's affected her. And then as time goes on for whatever reason and it's common, you see this in all relationships, it shifts to instead of receiving that compliment, it shifts to a well, you just have to say that. Well, no, actually, I don't really. I mean, it's the choice I'm making. You know, it's it's my opinion. It's my thought. And I'm expressing it to you. And I want you to know that I think you look beautiful. And I think in the end of that thing is, is you don't realize these subtleties that go on. But if you, if, if Brittany and I get dressed up, we're going out for a date. I tell her she looks beautiful. She dismisses that compliment and says, you know, you have to say that. But we get out and we meet friends. And, and or a stranger, somebody comes up and says, oh, you look beautiful. I love what you've done with your hair. And they get that giggle and that blush. Then I feel so dismissed. Right. And that person is now. It feel it feels to me like she values that person's opinion more than mine. But I'm supposed to be the person in the relationship. Right. And I'm not saying I'm, I'm, that's just the story. The, the paradigm is set up and just yeah, just don't be dismissive of your partner's compliments because they in all truth, they do not have to give them to you. It's it's a choice that's made by each person in the relationship. And in the same way, um, you know, to, to flip it in something that could possibly happen, uh, switch paradigms, just in, in Brittany and I's relationship, she loves to cook, so I don't cook a lot. But if I do cook dinner and she says that was delicious and I turn around and say, you just have to say that, you know, all of a sudden it's like, I don't actually value what she thought of the dinner I've made. And so it's, it's just value what your partner says to you, especially if that's the person you're in the committed relationship with that you trust more than you get into a relationship with somebody. You're basically saying, I trust you more than I trust most people. I trust you with the secrets of my life. I trust you with my feelings. I trust you with all these things. And then to turn around, and dismiss their opinions, dismiss their feelings is, is actually pretty detrimental to a relationship. There's a whole flip side to that too, though. It's and these are just kind of social norms. It's fully expected if 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 we get dressed up, we're going out. It's fully expected almost for me to give that compliment. And that's why it's so easy to dismiss. But it's okay to turn around for any any women listening or partners listening. Turn around, give your give your give your husband a compliment. Give your boyfriend a compliment. Say, you know, I I like the tie you got on. I like your shoe. You know, say something because. Man, you want to talk about building somebody's confidence. Those those things are huge confidence boosters.